Before we get into the new update, let me show you my new aura. If you haven't seen it, I'm gonna be probably saying this in every single video of mine now. This was made for me and uh, for me only. Uh. Oh my god, I made a full video on this, uh, like the idea behind it, what kind of sentence I use uh, and stuff like that. These guys are awesome. So anyways, this is it. That's the video. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, let's go. All right, so let's talk about the new updates here, okay? Anyways, by the way, I have to like put cream in my face. That's why it's so shiny right now um, Let's talk about it. Ah, uh, god damn it. There's so much good stuff in here So Halloween event is over, uh, but you can still get those uh, Halloween events I'm gonna quickly show you how you can get them. Uh, you go into the PvP zone, right? Uh, and you're gonna go and take uh, that and that and you're gonna go in here and you can see that you can still buy them uh, because many people had candies left over and they got angry uh, for that. So uh, yeah, you can come over here and you can buy yourself some good parts. Parts to actually uh, watch out for is definitely, I would say Kajun uh, and Nikali, they're really famous. And also if we go over here, um, I think for this might be the best uh, defense bay out there right now, which is Balmong. So you, you can still spend it so make sure to do that uh, very important I'm actually right after this video uh, right after I'm done actually you know what I'm gonna do that now I'm gonna I'm gonna pull them right now so uh, let's turn this on on and there you go 5k each so I'm gonna put this on down like you can't see it anymore uh, let's talk about the patch here mm, okay so uh, we're gonna talk about the Halloween event here which is interesting Halloween uh, items are no longer obtainable and they will likely come back uh, next year again which is really really good oh you can oh now you can see my mouse that's good um, they added new daily rewards 50% uh, XP daily for 30 minutes Better than nothing, right? Uh, so go ahead and uh, do your dailies. Uh, added welcome chat message that shows when you spawn into the game. Pretty good too. Uh, added new uh, refresh VFX. Uh, refresh is a skill, so that's nice. Uh, added search bar to customization. I wanted to check that out actually. Uh, so uh, I'm gonna do that later. Oh my god, I just pulled super tanky on Bell Moon. That's my second uh, super tanky part on that. That's quite interesting. Uh, really difficult to obtain though as well. Um, okay, so what else do we have? Uh, da, 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 da. There we go. Optimization. Oh, there's by the way. Yeah, this is it. Optimization uh, for streaming parts. That's the most important thing. I'm going to show this to you real quick. Uh, wait, let me stop here so you can see everything. Uh, this is huge for uh, content creators. I was actually the one that asked for it. Uh, I actually asked uh, into the CC chat for it and my praise is my my prayers have been heard by the lords up there somewhere uh, lords multiple ones hello sir anyways if we press I don't know if it's only for content creators but uh, for me it is uh, shift and P and what I can do now is uh, you know navigate throughout this is huge for content creators you can now go by and take some awesome like screenshot type of pictures here without you know everything in them I can actually clip through this as well I hope that this is not being uh, I don't know, like, uh, exploited for anything, but, uh, you know, now we can actually do some cool, uh, you know, uh, things. Maybe we can find some interesting Easter eggs, uh, where you always wanted to go under the map, through the map. Uh, I might be doing an exploration. If you're interested in that, I might be doing an explore. Wait, I have to go into here. Uh, I might be doing an in uh, exploration, uh, uh, thing here for you guys. If you're really interested, like, have you ever thought that you would see the game out of the ship's view? No, you have not thought about that I have for you oh my god so this uh, if I would be a developer I would put like really interesting stuff in here <laughs> like an Easter egg for people that like kind of get here um, anyways so this is huge for content creators because um, yeah you can just like uh, explore now take some amazing shots of the world it's it's huge like this PvP tournament I, I already see a thousand thumbnails in here this is absolutely insane I'm so happy that they uh, accepted my request here I'm I'm beyond beyond speechless so let's get back to uh, the update log here so let's turn this one off and there you go you can see the update log again so uh, yeah very nice update uh, cause uh, yeah enabling streaming enable I, I guess I don't know I don't even know if that is like 
that thing uh, I think they might have need, even not put it in here because they should have added that you, you need to use like shift and P but anyways it was told to me that it's implemented now um, okay so I don't know is it streaming I don't know balancing draculic evasion um, uh, duration nerf from 4.3 to 3 seconds and cooldown nerf from 11 to 13 I actually thought and I like draculic evasion this is a cool skill because it initially gives you an iframe um, but I uh, the, the thing here with that is though I thought it was too long like when I used it I thought it was way too long because most of these skills are not as long as that like you're running and speeding around for 4.5 almost five seconds here right you've been running around and then you're like oh this is taking a while like five seconds that's a long time 4.5 seconds still long time so three seconds I think that's absolutely valid and the cooldown is nerfed from 11 to 13 uh, some people might be like oh wow that's well but you know it is okay uh, Whirlpool now disables boost and any incoming speed after Whirlpool is used it reduced uh, two-thirds of its original amount interesting uh, yeah yeah pretty good uh, that the, that it disables boosts I guess so very nice uh, gluttony is now limited to two stacks in PvE and three stacks in PvP uh, trainers and players uh, I don't know does anybody use gluttony has anyone used it I don't see many people using Gluttony, to be honest, but uh, maybe now is a reason for them to do so? I have no idea. Uh, then we have Dragon Breath and Minotaur's Rampage. Now only targets plus hits the nearest target. Uh, both also have auto-aim now as well. That's pretty good. Uh, because I, I think it's somewhere like the uh, Dr uh, Reaper's Revenge, where it automatically targets uh, the player. So... I guess that's pretty cool too. Yeah, let, I'll, I'll take it. Dragon Breath and Minotaur's Rampage. Minotaur's Rampage was squishy as hell. Maybe that kind of like took that away a little bit here. Um, but yeah, so yeah, Dragon Breath again, cool, very strong. This is another buff basically for defense. Uh, Minotaur's Rampage you have in attack and defense. So uh, really interesting. Cool change. I like it. I like it. It's a good change. Uh, let's talk about the bugs and changes here. Um, increase because that's where things get interesting for everybody. So uh, increase PvP reward cooldown for fighting the same player. Okay, cool. Uh, reduced music volume in main menu. Didn't know that there was a loud music because that mine is always turned off because of copyright issues or for the videos. Uh, redu uh, reduced volume of Emperor sound. Yeah, I don't know about that. Effect when Emperor joins. Uh, made main menu music mutable. Holy smokes, these are 5Ms. Made main menu music mutable. Wow. I'm <laughs> via settings. That's good, I guess. Uh, fixed teleport prompt popping up in menu. That's nice. Fixed uh, being able to promote kick clan members that are in battle. Okay. Uh, fix some uh, skills not bypassing iframe shark bite and that is where we quickly have to talk um, Shark bite was the reason why we had to rerun some of the matches in the tournament now I want to get this tournament done and I'm not gonna rerun and uh, remake the entire tournament because that's where people So if you said hey, don't you want to think about it? No, I don't and that is 100% final I will not be rerunning all of these matches I will go forward with the tournament because I want it done. I'm done with this stuff. I'm done dealing with these guys I mean I love them dearly and I have a lot of fun talking to them in chat they're really cool people in there some of them I would even consider my friends but I'm gonna tell you one thing I am done dealing with these guys I'm done with it so uh, yeah I'm just <laughs> these guys are horrible sometimes oh my god they've been pushing my nerves you can't even believe anyways uh, I'm moving forward with a tournament uh, I will re redo two matches but that's it uh, you know, I'm, uh, there might be one more match that I might want to redo. Might be, but I'm not entirely sure yet. But the other ones that have moved on further, I will continue to upload those. So, yeah. Uh, okay, and that is basically it. Uh, Shark Bite has been fixed. That's like the, the most important part out of the entire thing. Uh, and then also, was that just edited? Reaper's Revenge and Star Scourge tracking fixed. That's good. Was that just changed right now? I don't know because it like was that there a second ago? I don't even know, uh, but it might be. Uh, if there are any bug, uh, bugs, please report it into bugs. Blah blah blah. Include screenshot or console <sighs> log, and that's good. 
Okay, I expect there to be a few bugs with uh, the optimization update, so if you encounter any, make a, po a post in the bug reports. Also for the tournament, if there's any more bugs, I will not rerun any matches, uh, it, it's just too stressful. Um, okay, so, codes we have in here as well, and obviously we don't want to read what that says. Um, at here, we added the candy vending machine, yeah, that's what I just sh showed you guys, to the PvP world uh, until uh, the 16th, which... Oh, my voice for anyone that has candy left to spend this is awesome this is a big w this big fire to anyone that has uh, a daily quest that has pumpkin objectives uh, you need to skip uh, the day until uh, wait until your day uh, daily re oh my god quests refresh <laughs> you won't lose your streak streak is lost after three days of inactivity and uh, that's good I am happy. I'm happy with this entire update. I, I love this entire update. This is huge, huge for me. First of all, because of that aura, right? That is that, that that's just huge for me, for my from for myself and itself. It is a tier 7 aura and it's only specifically made for me. You see, it's the abducted aura. There's no icon in it. I didn't send them any, so <laughs> so there we go. That's what I have to live with. Um, and other than that, man, guys, I, I can tell you. Mm, this is huge Th uh, for me personally and for content creators I know there's not a lot of content creators out there, but uh, for, for us, it's huge. And also the changes for the tournament, huge too. So, uh, b b crazy big changes. Very happy about it. Thank you guys very much so, uh, for that. Awesome. 